Yeah, man. So they finding artifacts here and shipping them over there to Iraq to help support the false notion of the East being older than the West, which is the Far East. I laughed at the World News article from Routers that I shared because they needed more evidence than just the few Sumerian clay tablets that they took from the Americas to the Mesopotamia region, which is now present day Iraq, just to sell this ancient Middle East story to begin with. <coughs> Shalak. It takes <coughs> Shalak, it takes a really good thief to be able to smuggle 3,800 artifacts, including stone tablets, from Iraq to America. How was that possible? You see, their excuse to explain away the 3,800 Sumerian artifacts does not even make sense. Therefore, the Sumerian artifacts were native to the Americas. Oh. Now, this is very believable because you already learned via my previous book, America is the True Old World, Volume 1. So, get both volumes, you know what I'm saying? Um, I mean, look, all this, you're going to need it all. You're going to need, you know, things in here that we got to learn. And, you know, we got to write our book because we're going to have things in there that they're going to have to learn. Right. So we just got to write. You know, we just got to put it out there. You know what I'm saying? Just look out for us, man. That's what it, this is really coming to. You know, it's not about YouTube or social media. It's about publications. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Uh, media, you know, what I'm saying film and, 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 and music, you know, and really doing it. You know what I'm saying? And then showing you what. Whatever we doing, we're going to, you know, let you in on it. <laughs> you know, you can surf the wave, but we got to do it. And this is what this fifth wave is really all about. You know what I mean? Just getting ready to do it. We're just getting ready. We're just getting started. And the price is going up, man. We on a war path, my nigga. The price is going up. American Holocaust. Man, it's good to be in the ether with my noggers, man. You, you know, sometimes we got to get the house in order and take breaks. And sometimes, you know, it's difficult to get back in the flow, man, because you got so much extra, extra happening. You know what I'm saying? Man, we fight for it, the ether squad. Hey, Hob, I love y'all, man, for real. It's, it's something we all fighting for to get the information to y'all, to keep the rhythm going. And when I'm not, you know, popping off, my jigger popping off, my spiral popping off, yourself popping off, Ty Battle popping off, Brother Nature popping off, Chef Candy popping off, CJ Battle popping off, Templar popping off, Natural popping off, man. It's all happening, man. <laughs> Judah the Great Jedi's popping off, Con Cloud Bay, it's popping off. It's all happening, man. It's the American Hawk. Wow. Man, it's crazy, man. They want to hijack our soul. You know, that's what the American Holocaust is all about, man. Hijacking your soul. You know, they even got their own forked tongue of, you know, they, they got, <laughs> you know, they'll take a, a word, you know, which is neutral, and they'll put an intention on it. So they'll take, uh, you know, a word like Khan, right? Now, Khan means priest in our language, but they'll make it like pros and cons. Like, Khan's got to be like the convict. Like, you got to be a bad person. <laughs> you know? Um, wow. You know, they'll take... Uh, <laughs> we just read about Saturnalia and how they connect this, um, this Jupiter, this Hove character, this... Um, what they call it... Uh, Oh, Esus character, right? <laughs> E-S-U-S. And they're also connecting with soul in Invictus or Invictus. They got different variations of their souls. I'm like, damn, they even hijacking 
the soul. They <laughs> they trying to turn it into their hijack gods and deities and Jupiter. Nah, man, we taking it all back. We taking all our frequency back, man. We taking our soul back, our soul bone. So just because they got a hijacked son, we can't have a hijacked free son. We can't be the first beloved son. <laughs> David can't be the first son. Son got to be a hijack because they got son. So just because they got soul, <laughs> they got a hijacked soul, don't mean we can't have our soul. If they got their son, we got our son. <laughs> they got their uh, Christ. They got their anointed. We can have our own anointed, our own Hamashiach. Come. Yeah, man, we're taking our soul back. Look out for it, man. Top of the soul bone podcast, man. Look out for it. Man. That's all I'm going to say, man. We're stepping all the way up in the ether. We on Coon right now, if you don't know it, man. You know, we popping off for the fifth wave, man. It's great to be in the ether. This feels so good, man. Oh. The ether's awesome, man. You know, this is when I really get to talk on y'all. You know, it's a different thing, you know. It's a different thing, you know what I'm saying? So I appreciate y'all for being here, downloading the app. Uh, you know, if you ain't got it, if you're listening on the website, download it. Everything's free, man. Just surf the wave. It don't even take up a lot of space in your phone, you know what I'm saying? It's real simple to use. You just press play. It's, you know, real simple. Man. We're keeping things real simple <laughs> around here. Let's go. All right, so the Americas is the real Mesopotamia and the real Babylon. Sumerian culture because they have found thousands of Sumerian artifacts in the Americas, North, South, and Central America. And that's why when we look up David Sausland, you got the Georgian and the uh, Babylon titles on there. And all this is in the Americas, you know what I'm saying? All this is in the Americas. North, South, and Central America. According to Dr. Clyde Winter's book, quote, Ancient scripts of South America, the Sumerians in South America, end quote. The Sumerians were in South America because Sumerian scripts were found in South America. Now, so the, the Tower of Babel was the Colula Pyramid in Mexico. Well, the Tower of Babel and this is his investigation. You know, you can write it down. You can research it. I'm not here to confirm or deny. I'm just reading a book, sharing with you, you know, what this American Holocaust is about. <laughs> Why do they want to wipe you out? Damn near to extinction. You know what I'm saying? Why do they want you to think you're from Africa? Because that takes you out of antiquity. That takes you out <laughs> of all the drop. That's over here connected with the gateways to, to the portals to other lands beyond the poles. This is deeper than you think. This goes much deeper than you think. You're talking about land that popped out the primordial waters first, according to Gerald Massey. Yeah, man.